Hi, I'm Neely from Great Healing Getaways, and I want to report to you some news that I found of people and places that integrate holistic health and wellness from around the world. The top news story that I discovered was an herbal tea that may cure breast cancer. It's very exciting, but before I share that with you, I want to tell you about a conference that's happening. It is the conference of the 13th International Congress of the International Society for Entho-Pharmacology. It's at the University of Graz, and it's starting September 2nd. And plants and other natural treatments for various ailments are going to be discussed. It's very exciting because they will be discussing active ingredients from red wine, Amazonian plants, hops, Indian basil, and legumes will be the talking points for the Congress attendees. As possible remedies for what they're going to talk about is type 2 diabetes, Alzheimer's disease, and rheumatism. So that's very exciting because this is much needed natural cures. Now there's going to be more than 400 scientists from over 60 countries are expected to attend the conference. And they're going to be discussing natural remedies, both traditional and modern, overusing chemical approaches with the central discussion, uh, which is what the University of Graz press release stated on Tuesday. Um, one of the guys that's heading this is Rudolf Baer, and his quote is, traditional knowledge is not only valuable, but also at risk, which is pretty exciting. And he said, for example, estrogen-like substances found in hops aids with postmenopausal symptoms. And ingredients found in red wine is known for the antioxidant and anti-inflammatory effects. Well, I'm very happy to hear that they're finally giving some attention to all the natural remedies that we have been using and been successful with. All right, now to the top story I found, herbal tea may cure breast cancer. This came out last week, and it's basically scientists at the Austin University and Russell's Hall Hospital have discovered that there's an extract from a common plant in Pakistan that may help cure breast cancer. The plant is called Fagonia critica, and it's also known as Virgin's mantlum. It's commonly used in herbal tea, and it's been traditionally used to treat women in rural Pakistan who have breast cancer. Up until now, this treatment has been regarded as something of a folklore remedy. However, the patients in Pakistan who have been taking the plant extract have reported that it does not appear to generate any of the serious common side effects known by other treatments, such as losing your hair, drop in blood count, diarrhea, nausea, etc. So now the scientists at the Austin University in Birmingham and Russell's Hall Hospital in Dudley have undertaken tests of the plant extract and proved that it kills cancer cells without this damage to normal breast cells and laboratory conditions. The two professors that are heading this is Professor Griffith and Professor Carmichael. They're leading the study and they're now aiming to identify which element or elements of this plant are responsible for killing the cancer cells with a view to eventually begin the trials with human cancer patients. Folk medicine fights cancer without side effects. I love it, and uh, I just wanted to share that with you. Thanks.